the terrible mystery of death. Divine revelation to Saint Macarius from Egypt about whether the soul goes after death. When Abbas Macarius from Egypt was walking through the vast desert, an angel was following his steps. He turned around to see and he greeted him very respectfully. Bless me, Saint Lord, Saint um, Holy Saint. Abbas Macarius thought that he was someone, someone from the monks of uh, from the desert, and he said, and, uh, giving back uh, the, rela- the the greetings, God bless you, my child, and forgive you. They walked together for some time, and then the Saint, the Holy Saint, seeing the whole um, the whole appearance of the person uh, beside him. Who was lightning as much uh, as the, the, uh, the sun asked him my child this is the first the first time I see you and I have a question I, uh, I am admiring your appearance who is lightning like a light like a big light and you're very very beautiful a very beautiful person and um, as, as a person, I have never seen such a person before, lightning like, like, like the sun and being so beautiful. And I began to wonder, um, maybe you're not a person. So I beseech you in the name of the Lord, tell me what is the truth. Then the, the, the angel um, bowed before the, the holy saint and he told him, Bless me, Saint Father. As you saw yourself, I'm not a person, but I'm an angel. And I came to teach you the unknown mysteries you don't know, you don't, you don't know, and you wish so much to know. So, ask me and I will uh, respond to you. Then, Saint, Mac- uh, Saint uh, Macarius uh, made a bow to the Saint, to the saint uh, Angel. And he uh, just looked at the sky and said, Thank you, Lord, who, um, who put yourself, or who put your, your eyes upon your, your servant, and he gave me a guide and teacher to teach me as I don't know, and I, I really want to, to know from the bottom of my heart. And uh, then the angel tells the Saint Lord, the Saint, uh, the Holy Saint, Come, come, uh, Holy Saint and Father, tell me what is in your, in your thought, what are your questions? Then Abbas said, Please tell me, Saint, Saint Angel, the, the persons who are resting after their death, Leave this place and go to another place which is uh, eternal. And uh, they, do they know each other? Listen, Saint Father, uh, said the angel. As uh, it happens in this world that people uh, go to bed and uh, in, at night and wake up in the morning, and when they wake up, they know each other, uh, they know each other and the people around them the people who that uh, they had seen the previous day, and they talk together, and or walk together, or read together, or drink together, or make fun with uh, them, asking each other uh, some uh, things. That happens in the other world too. Everybody sees and recognizes the man b- beside him, and he's very happy uh, when. Uh, uh, they walk together and talk together. Uh, that happens. Uh, that happens over there, and uh, it is just like uh, here that when somebody gets out of his house or going to the market and he sees poor uh, or lords or um, or other people and asks, "Who's that?" and or, "Who's uh, who's that person?" or "Who's this person?" And uh, by asking, they learn who goes uh, near them. 
uh, that happens over there, high, the high above uh, the heavens, with the right, righteous people. I say again, the righteous people, because this privilege does not exist with the sinners. Uh, as they were walking, Abbas Makarius uh, asks the angel again, please tell me, um, after this very hard separation from heart, from the soul, from the body, what happens? And when this, uh, this, this separation happens, and the soul takes its own way, why do we make all those uh, memorials for uh, the uh, people who have slept? The angel uh, took a big breath, and uh, uh, began to, uh, to respond. Listen, Holy Father, after the separation of, uh, the, heart of the, soul, the soul of the body, the, then, uh, the, the, uh, then some holy angels come, and the third day, take the soul and take it before the heavens, on the heavens, to bow before our Lord Jesus Christ, but I also have to tell you that in this all in in all this uh, um, uh, uh, space in all this this time that happens uh, uh, that means that all the space be, be between earth and and sky there is a very big uh, ladder which has a lot a lot of uh, steps and in every step we see um, a battalion of demons who are called Helens. These Helens are very evil, evil spirits who just, who, who uh, when they uh, see a soul, they carry with them uh, a lot of uh, papers who are written and say which time and what place and where, uh, he stole, he said lies, he did this, he did the other, or made uh, or committed a crime, or uh, did something was illegal, or something that was not uh, uh, holy, or he uh, fell into adultery, or, or other things, or whatever sins that the person has done, and uh, the, the demons have written that thing uh, in full detail. Then the holy uh, the holy angels take other scriptures, other re uh, written documents, who write inside what good things had this, the soul had done in this world. So they um, see which of uh, the two scriptures are uh, more, and so the angels and the, and the demons. Um, find which which are the, the most of what they have done, the good things or the bad things, and they take the soul. Uh, who uh, ever has uh, most of the scriptures takes the soul. The angel soul. The um, the angels after that take that and put it in at the other step higher than that. When the, the demons see that uh, uh, the soul has uh, gone out of their hands because it has done more good thing, good deeds than the bad things, and they see that the soul climbs to a, a higher level and a higher uh, step, they uh, just growl because they are very angry, like uh, growling dogs, and uh, they are very um they are very um they act like very angry dogs and ghouls and they throw themselves upon the angels so that they can take the soul or they take the soul uh, even uh, even in the last moment of uh, this uh, this whole act uh, they hope that they would take the soul with them so the soul is very, very scared of all that thing and tries to hide itself under the wings of the angels so that 
he can um, get away from the hands of the, of the bad wolves, the bad uh, demons. So there is a big fight, talking and fighting between the angels and the demons until uh, the soul is um, released from the hands and uh, the claws of these uh, angry and bearful demons. So the angels get the soul and put it forward uh, one step at a time. There they find another talent who is more fearful and more fierce than the, the previous one. So the demons uh, do the same again, a big fuss, a big noise, and they try to win the soul again. They start to, uh, to scream and shout and uh, uh, making, um, making some uh, uh, bad art deeds to the soul, saying things. Well, who are you who are trying to get higher? Uh, you're, you are the one who uh, fell into adultery. You are the one who um, uh, insulted the mystery of the holy of the holy baptism. Aren't you the one who, with uh, your actions, uh, made uh, made dirt on the angel angel um, angel gown that you were wearing? What do you think that you're going back there? Go back. You, you don't belong up there. You have to go back. Come down again. Come to the, to, um, to the hell with us. And go, go down to hell. Go to, uh, to the fire so that uh, uh, the worms and the, uh, the, the fire start, um, start destroying you. And, and then the soul who is worthy of the internal hell uh, gets out of the hands of uh, the angels there and the demons take it and put it down to hell into a very um, a very awful place and very fearful place and that is the worst thing that happens to that soul people should never never go there down there and uh, people would say um, this is the worst place that ever happens in uh, the face of the of uh, uh, the earth, and then the, uh, you get very very sad to see those souls who are condemned to live in that hell, and you would see them, my holy father, that they have a very great need not to have anything else to uh, hold the sem themselves from. Uh, this is a great sadness and a great pain who nobody can bear. So, when, uh, when the soul is found pure and without sins, then uh, with the angel is going up the ladder one by one and it feels a great joy to go in, uh, um, uh, up the stairs. Every, every now and then uh, it meets an other angels who are, um, uh, 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 and as the deacons in the church hold uh, lit, lit candles and uh, they smell, uh, they smell a beautiful scent. And these angels um, kiss, kiss that soul with a lot of love. Uh, then they take it to the Lord's um, uh, holy place, the, whole, the Lord's uh, throne, and then it bows before our Lord Jesus Christ and our, and our, our God, and then it sees all the holy apostles, the holy martyrs, the holy fathers, the nine battalions of the holy saints, the holy angels, and it is with great brightness he hears the um, the angelic melody, and it, it gets very very happy, and um, it sees 
some beauty that nobody, nobody can describe. All the saints, uh, all the saints, the, the, the angel continues, are um, love. Um, all the saints love the people, and they want to help them. And they see, and they see the people uh, with a lot of love and uh, prosperity. Uh, but from uh, people's place, from the from 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 you, the people. They get, they had, they get bad actions, who uh, made the angels very angry about it and uh, don't and don't uh, don't like those bad souls at all. I have I um I also has have to, to told you holy 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 men that this uh, uh, that the uh, ang that these angels. Have a very uh, great love to, uh, and mercy for the people, and because of uh, that, and because uh, they want the people to be self 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 uh, salvaged, they want to uh, go to to God. They want to go to God, and they want to, to help them go to God. They want to be salvaged. Uh, they want the, the people's salvation. Uh, beside those, we have our Lady Theotokos, Mother of God, who cares more than everyone the human the human species. Uh, my Holy Father, you should, as every person, have always in his mouth the name of Theotokos of Maria, of Maria, the Mother of God, and bless her and uh, ask her. And thank her for everything that she does to the, the uh, to you. But the devil uh, um, made a trick and and threw he uh, threw him into um, non loving Theotokos of not uh, being being grateful to Theotokos and forget that uh, the Lord today is as it is. And as it is today, it is uh, all all due to uh, um, prayings and um, good deeds of Theotokos to the human race. Unfortunately, people that um, saw some uh, redemption, redemption, and they uh, didn't want to be with a God and in saints. Uh, Something that uh, surely God and the saints uh, will, uh, by in their terms, show them the same, uh, the same thing as the people had shown to them. The holy saints, seeing that uh, the angel was very reluctant, uh, was very willing to tell him all those questions and answer that, he wanted to. Um, Make more questions, and he wanted to make the holy angel respond about about the sins. And so he asked, "Please, holy angel, tell me if you want, uh, which is the greatest of all the sins that a man can do?" Holy Father said, "The angel, every sin who may, who the person does." Uh, throws him away from God, separates him from God. It seems that some of the sins, as uh, as um, having bad feelings for other people and blasphemy, are uh, more uh, than uh, and above all the others. And they themselves only by themselves are able. To make the person go down the hell, under the earth and under the sea. The holy, the holy man, saw that he was not satisfied with the answer. He wanted to make uh, the same question under another another uh, form. Tell me, holy angel, which of the sins uh, are? Is which of the sins God uh, hates more than 
all the others. Vanity, said the holy angel. Do you know that the monk, the, the nun, uh, that only uh, this sin uh, has turned has turned the world into fall and to destruction and because of it uh, Adam the first man who was ever made uh, went out of heavens and uh, besides that and because of that the uh, the biggest uh, demon was uh, gone down uh, from uh, the holy place that he was up uh, in the heavens with uh, the other angels and because of that Pharisee, Pharisee uh, lost all, all the, the good deeds of uh, his uh, um, actions and that's why if the person uh, falls into the sin of vanity is very difficult to get up. Then the Lord, uh, then the holy man, um, asks another question about the uh, uh, punishment of the sinful, the sinful people. Which persons, which sinful persons, are uh, get bigger, um, bigger punishments than the others? I told you, said the holy angel. Most of all are the people who um, had made some bad things and the blasphemer, uh, the people who do um, things that cannot be said and done, and uh, the blasphemer. So, uh, we ha I also have to add that above all, all the hells, there is one which is the greatest of all, and they called him, um, they called him uh, non-existent, non-existent hell. There, the souls are punished to suffer the sinful uh, uh, clerks, the sinful um, priests, along with the monks and the, um, and the nuns who fell into. Um, bad things among uh, one another. That's why holy, holy, uh, holy men. It is written that the battalion of angels who fell and became demonic. These will be renowned and will be replaced and will come to a great glory and honor from the good and holy uh, priests and monks. And as I told you, the bad and sinful and evil monk who fall into the great, uh, in, in this great deed, are sent to hell, just like the priests who um, violate the holy scriptures and the holy laws. They are uh, all those who uh, uh, accept uh, bad deeds and the bad people because they fill their um, pockets, their priest, three priestly pockets, with uh, um, money and with presents and a lot of other things. And those who uh, set aside all their ecclesiastical um, things that they have to do uh, in favor of uh, the world, worldly deeds and social and social deeds and uh, all these people will have to give a word to the Lord about what they had done and what should I say about the priests who drink that is the worst of all and uh, they should fear that because they will go to hell. Tell me. The Holy Father asked the angel again, please tell me what happens to the people who don't pay attention and don't pay respect to the day of the Sunday. And then the angel responds, this is the very bad thing for them 
and they should fear that holy holy father because they await uh, they await a very terrible punishment and hell for not respecting sunday the person who do, who doesn't respect uh, sunday or despise sunday it is just like he despises the lord himself so that the lord at that day he will despise him also because the day of the sunday is the day of the lord who respects and honors the lord respects and honors the sunday and the lord protects him the lord protects him for the same in the same way whoever respects and honors and celebrates the memories of the saints gets a great help from them uh, in his own life because they have a lot of courage and a lot of um boldness to ask the lord something and the lord gives it through so through their pleading and um, praying uh, of the of the saints for us the people who love the saints take what they want from uh, god and they take a lot of help and a lot of blessings from him so we have to uh, say holy father that most of the people who had have, have given away or sent away the fear of the lord from inside them so not even the lord they have as a friend or even any of the saints have as a friend but they have attached themselves to the life and the cosmical all the things that happen in the cosmos in the world around them and these people are destroying themselves and perish themselves uh, this is very bad for them you should know holy for holy father that every person who does not honor and does not respect the holy day of sunday either he is a priest either he is a monk or something else or just a simple person from the from the world he will never see the face of the lord or ever uh, ever have anyone who will give him the hope of salvation uh some times of uh, um not speaking past nobody or not none of them were speaking and this was a very important silence that happened between uh the lord the the holy father and at this end the, the holy angel all those thoughts that were passing through of us macarius uh, thoughts were interrupted by the the holy angel if you have something else to ask me holy father ask do it now ask it now because it is time for me to go up to the heavens to my lord the avas was uh, breathing heavily then because he did not want uh, the angel to leave so he whispered uh, tearing uh, with a lot of tears uh, this is bad for us very very bad for us our good our good and holy servant of my lord uh, as an angel an angel as it is with no body and no sins he is in a hurry to go up in the skies and give um, blessings and love to his lord while us who have body and want to uh, respect and uh, live with uh, uh, um this not with the spiritual things but with the things who will, uh, who uh, that we live uh, by we the sinners who never take care of our souls and we despise everything that could bring uh, salvation to us and he 
continued to cry, and then out loud he asked the angel, Please tell me, holy angel, uh, I want to know a prayer that uh, matches more to the monks. If somebody knows le, uh, how to read and write, the angel responds, he can say the Psalms of David, but if he doesn't know any, any uh, writing and reading, he can pray uh, to the Lord with the following words. Our Lord, my Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, please forgive my sins and please help me, the sinner. This is the most powerful prayer of all and it is the most easy one, the easiest one. So, a lot of monks who don't know how to read and write, they abandoned all other prayers and held this one, held this prayer and say, say it out loud or inside them without stopping. And with this prayer, they save themselves. This, this so simple but so effective uh, prayer, it can be said day and night, continuously, by young men and old men, by men and women, by monks and nuns, by the people who know how to read and write and the people who don't know how to read and write. The, um, people who have experience and the people who don't have any experience and whoever wants to save his soul he can also keep this prayer in his mouth in his lips and in his heart day and night either in his cell either in the street or being upright or working or sitting or resting even if even if he is in the streets or he travels or he doing some other deed and in, uh, in his heart he has this prayer, it is, that prayer is possible to give the salvation of the soul to whoever wishes it so uh, fearfully, fervently. The old man thought to be very uh, happy but he didn't want to stop um, the, uh, the questions because he wanted the angel to stay with him for a long, long time. So he says to the angel, because my dear uh, holy angel came to me to teach me, me the sinner, uh, please tell me this, this also. If there is a man who is very sinful, uh, happens to find the uh, right situation, to teach another person who is sinful also. And with this, in this way, he shows them the good deeds and the good way of the Lord and take him, uh, takes him out of the sin. This, this deed, will it give him some spiritual uh, benefit? Then the, the holy angel laughed and said, Whoever teaches another sinner, and manages to take him out of the of the way of the sin, putting him in the way of the righteousness. And not only he gets the soul of that person out of hell, but he will also save his his soul, because he will cover an, a great number of uh, sins, as the holy scriptures say. Just as if someone, uh, just as if someone else uh, who advises a bad person and uh, leads him to do evil things, not only he will uh, um, drive that person to the loss, to the destruction, but he will also uh, surrender himself to the bad deed and his soul will be surrendered to demons. So, everybody would say that there is no greater sin than 
advises someone, uh, advises a person to the evil and the loss, just like there is no better thing, no better deed than um, advises someone to towards the good and the salvation of the man. And finishes these words, the angel uh, put about and, uh, and uh, paid respect to the Holy Father, saying, Please forgive me and bless me, Holy Father. Then the law of the, uh, the Holy Father bowed before the Holy Angel, and he said, Go in peace, Holy Angel, and where you go and be with the Holy Trinity, Please say a prayer and uh, say a good, a good word for me and for the salvation of my soul. Please do that. So the holy angel opened his wing and threw and threw himself and flew himself towards the sky, while Avras Makaris Aebes Makarius said thank you to the Lord. He returned to his cell again. And then he said all what he saw and heard to his faithful brother and his uh, um, uh, um, and the monk who was with him, uh, exercising with him, praising and thanking the name of the holy name of the Lord.